What is up guys? I'm going to show you this tarp real quick. Show you a couple reasons why you don't want to buy it. So, uh, let's start with number one. Alright. Number one reason is these straps. Nice Velcro straps, right? That actually tie it to the vehicle. Well, they're complete junk. I don't know if you can see that. But all the threads ripped out of it. It's going to be hard to see on this camera, but you can see the light holes there in it. So there's no way to see. Here's the Velcro part right here. So that's number one. They break all around, basically. One in the center here. You can see where its threads are. I don't even know where it went. Here it is. Come right off just by the wind. I'd like to mention, I've only had this tarp for about a week now. Uh, they have these elastic, on, uh, not elastic, but uh, Velcro on the sides too. But they don't reach. Like they will not wrap around this step. And this is basically a factory step. So luckily there's grommets there to run bungee cords. And that is one thing nice. This is multi-layered. I don't know if you can see that. So the grommet is between a layer, so the bungee cord ain't actually touching the truck. There's material behind that grommet. I don't know where it is, because it's hard to find, but there's already a tear on this main seam already ripping apart. What is it this thing? I don't know, but I could see right through it into the bed, the other day, so it's already ripping. The rear ones are holding up. But who knows how long they will last. Again, it does have the nice grommets with the material behind it where it does not touch the truck and that is nice flat tire but yeah here's my main thing is these are just coming ripping off at the threads here and that is not good because there's no way to hold the tarp down because only two grommets on this tarp one on each side if it had like one on front and back too I wouldn't be even making this review because I could be around you know just use the bungee cords but yeah oh so there's thread there I guess that's where that one that cord came up to and this is the center I could probably easily just rip that off because it's just naturally doing it. So yeah. This is a $60 tarp by the way. So I don't recommend it for that reason because it will not last the winter. You know if it can't make it through a week of a little bit of wind, you know it's winter in Kentucky. So we don't have much of a winter but we have wind and rain. So yeah, sixty dollars. Don't recommend it. <laughs> so in my opinion, the tarp is complete junk. It's a sixty dollar tarp. I'll leave the information in the description of when I bought it, what it is, and that reminds me, on the first night of installing that tarp, is when that passenger front strap just ripped off for no reason. Then, I don't know, a few days later, I, the front one was on the ground. And that's the only way to hold that tarp on is with those straps because there's only grommets on each side because the straps on each side are not long enough. 
like I said, I don't know what they're expecting you to tie those off to because those bars ain't that far away, so there's no way you could uh, wrap it around the frame or anything, or even on a hole in the rocker panel because it won't reach this, won't tie around the bar. And like I said, those steps are they're aftermarket steps, but they're copies of the factory steps. They're just black. But there's two grommets there, which is like I said, the grommets are nice. They're plastic grommets, but they have the material that flaps over the back. So when the hook goes through the grommet, there's still material behind the hook for where the metal on the strap or on the bungee cord doesn't hit the truck, scratch the paint or anything. Not that that really matters to me. Mainly the only reason I'm putting the tarp on it really is just to save the paint a little bit and to keep the dash and stuff from. Uh, you know, dry rotting, weather cracking. So yeah, I don't know what to do with my tarp. I'm gonna try to get my money back on it, which at the same time is like I don't know if I even want to mess with that. Uh, but yeah, sixty dollar tarp don't last a week or last a well, it's gonna last more than a week, but the tie downs first one didn't last a day really so alright that's it sorry for the video <laughs> you guys know how I am later